Understanding Widespread Panic. Hello, and welcome to today's English language learning session. In this video, we will unravel the meaning and usage of the phrase, widespread panic. This phrase is often heard in news reports and daily conversations, especially when discussing large-scale events. Stick with us as we dive deep into this expression, helping you to not only understand it but also use it confidently in your own conversations. Widespread panic refers to a situation where a large number of people are experiencing intense fear or anxiety, and this feeling is spread over a wide area or among many people. The term widespread indicates that the panic is not localized but is affecting a broad area or a large population. The word panic signifies a sudden, uncontrollable fear, often causing wildly unthinking behavior. When you hear the phrase widespread panic, it's usually in contexts like natural disasters, financial market crashes, or other major events where public safety or well-being is at risk. It describes not just individual fear, but a collective state of alarm that can affect communities, cities, or even entire countries. To understand how to use widespread panic correctly, let's look at some examples. 1. The rumor about the earthquake led to widespread panic in the coastal city. 2. Here, the phrase illustrates how a rumor caused many people in a large area to become very scared. 3. Health officials are working hard to prevent widespread panic about the new disease. 4. In this sentence, widespread panic refers to the potential for many people to become very anxious about health risks. By looking at these examples, you can see that widespread panic is often associated with situations that are serious and involve a large group of people reacting to a perceived threat or actual danger. It's useful to know some synonyms or related phrases to understand different contexts where similar meanings are conveyed. Some synonyms for widespread panic include mass hysteria, collective anxiety, general alarm, while these terms share similarities with widespread panic, the nuances might change depending on the context, so it's always good to understand the specific situation being discussed. We hope this video has illuminated the meaning and usage of the phrase, widespread panic, for you. Understanding such phrases is crucial for mastering English especially if you're keen on following global news or engaging in deep discussions. Remember, language is not just about words but also about the emotions and situations they convey. Keep learning, and you'll keep growing. Thanks for watching, and we look forward to seeing you in our next video.